What's going on my lovely wolf cuck wolf pack? I'm all in the mic. As you can see, that's right, I'm gonna be talking about Kill a Kill. Now guys, I barely see anybody discuss this wonderful, beautiful looking game that's coming out in July, so I thought, why not? Let's actually start talking about Kill a Kill since it's coming soon and this game is already looking beautiful. So for you people who actually watch Kill a Kill, I'm pretty sure you already heard about the recent update. That's, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> that's going over Ryuko. Now, with the story mode already, you control Satsuki. You're controlling Satsuki during the whole story mode, and you're proceeding along with her, just going against different people. That's already, you know, within the original story. But they decided if you beat Satsuki's story storyline, if you beat her story mode, you will unlock Ryoko's own scenario from her point of view. Now, with that being said, pretty much after Ryoko was defeated by Satsuki, Nui appears up before her, and now she, apparently in the story. She wants to, she's determined to become stronger, so Ryuko really is going to ask Nui to train her. And as you can see this picture right here, we can see Nui training Ryuko. And eventually, she finds out the secrets of the original life fiber that's actually not in the original series. And as you can see right here, Ryuko gets a ultimate new skin. Now, me personally, the skin looks freaking amazing. So, I just wanted to actually throw in that update. I know a few days ago, actually a few weeks ago, Satsuki actually got her... <laughs> Junketsu Shinsui <laughs> the final form of Junketsu pretty much as you can see on the screen right here that's how that looks so actually this game is actually going to be looking pretty cool I know a lot of people didn't hear about this update but this oh my god so what do you guys feel about it are you going to get are you I'm going to ask I was about to ask are you going to get Junketsu are you getting the kill a kill game because honestly I, this, this that's two story modes already now the characters that we have right now that are currently in the game is of course Ryoko we have Ryoko we have Satsuki we have Gamaguri I'm pretty sure I pronounced his name wrong I can never do these names like Jesus Christ we have Uzu you know the the dude who me personally I don't even think he even needed to be in the anime because he just got waxed how many times like three or four we have Hoku pretty sure I pronounced him wrong too we have my lovely baby girl Nan Nan I'm gonna be doing a lot with her then we have Nui I, I want to say it's Nui or I'm pretty sure it's Nui Harame I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce her name I might be mistaking I think that's how you pronounce her name then we have I'm gonna call her ravioli we have Ragyo and then we have another Ryoko, but it's the dual wield Ryoko along with dual wield Satsuki. And then, of course, everybody's fan favorite. We have the baby girl, Mako. I'm not going to pronounce her last name because I'm probably going to get tongue tied. Just, I'm just going to call her Mako. So Mako is currently DLC right now. And then we have the ultimate double naked DTR, you know, the, the nudist beach class. You know, I'm not class, but nudist beach and two. So therefore, her and them two are currently DLC as well. I will actually do another video of the different battle modes that are currently in the game. But I'm going to actually, you know, start talking about Kill a Kill because this update right here just, it's amazing. Like the screenshots of how Ryoko looks, it's freaking clever and beautiful. And the fact that she gets her own story from her point of view that has nothing to actually do with the original series is actually amazing. So let me know what you guys think of that. Tell me if you're hyped for the Kill a Kill game. Let me know. And I hope to see y'all later.